The Queensland coal fields, one of the world's richest energy resources and for 150 years, an industrial battleground. No coal miner was ever handed anything. He had to fight for it. Go on strike. Whatever he got, he had to fight for. Otherwise, we wouldn't have got anything. And if they had a rally or anything, the women were all there with them. You know, the whole coal mining act is written in blood. We've had a lot of deaths, and that's not counting the amount of people being smashed up. Where you work eight hour shifts, you went to work, you done your work, you went home. Not now. What the mining companies are now doing with the destruction of the towns is they are mining the soul out of communities. They know the militancy and the history of those mining communities when they were residential towns and they're trying to destroy them. If you're a good boxer, you drop your guard, someone's going to punch you, aren't they? You can't drop your guard. This is the story of the Queensland mine workers, a story of struggle and tragedy and the battle for a fair go. It is a story written in blood. We've had all these fatalities here, and no one has ever been prosecuted. No one has even been fined $10.